put it all into one year, compress two years, the time. yeah, compress it, and then just build the money fast within that time. So I'm saying, mm -hmm. so some people work one job, and they work that one job, and it takes forever to build what they wanted. Okay? I'm gonna have to do something else, like you know, something else. I'm gonna no, but that's that's all the all thing. Right? Like, one job is enough. It's just you have to find out how to make money yeah. without exchanging your time for it. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Because in like, the beginning, you might have to start you, no, you, with that. you have to start with that. Yeah, because that's a, a nice, clean way to catch some clean money. Yeah. Money. And then, yeah, once you catch that, try to build. Like, if you go, let's say you go to work, <coughs> you go to work, there's something you like doing, sell what you sell your talent at work. Tell them, tell, tell yeah. that thing that you said that you're doing. Oh, I make money where I make money, nigga. This is what I do. Okay. Go to work. And my mom, she's a chef, so you know she that's her talent. She always wanted to be a chef, so I'm like, you know what? Let me make her dreams come true. So I, I she made food for me, I ate it at work, the people are liking it. Ate more, ate more, they're like feeling for it. They're like, yo, fam, that's some good food, let me get some. So I'm like, I know it's some good food, like my mom started is a chef. selling the food at work. I started selling her food, one client, two client, three, until it built. Now I'm making money where I make money, but all the money I make, I give it to my mom because that's her dream, you know? I'm not trying to eat her dream feeding her dream, you see what I'm saying? Now, I'm just trying to expand her her dream from the workplace to, to the neighborhood. And the neighborhood. the neighborhood to everywhere, you see what I'm saying? The community and stuff like that. Smart, Until man. it expands. Once it expands, because the amount of money my mom makes, she's making like a couple hundreds in a week off of just selling food. Just off of that? Yeah. Something she's already going to exactly. do anyway. Her talent. She's making money off of her talent. So imagine if she expands and she grows her clients. She officially has a business. A yeah. so it's a business. Then after, that's over, that's making more than me. Eventually that's going to be making more than I make at work. You see how you're thinking? Yeah, see? That then goes back to what I just told you. Yeah. It, yeah. It, it, it goes beyond exchanging your time for the money. Exactly. Now I'm exchanging talent. For the see? money. Yeah, exactly. Value. Yeah, real value. Because yeah. when you exchange your time, you're just losing. Because time is so You're limited. Big, you'll never get time back. But if you exchange your talent, you can always recreate because you're the talented one. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So you're Gifts. blessed. Yeah. You remember, God blessed you with a gift. Mm -hmm. to speak. Your blessing was made to be given. And once yes. you give, you will receive. If you have a blessing, you don't give your blessing. Don't expect nothing because you're not going to get nothing. Simple like that. If you're a rapper or a musician and you don't show the world your music, are you going to prosper? Are you going to succeed? No, you're not. Definitely not. But if you're a rapper or a musician or this or that and you show it to the world, watch how great you'll become. This is why you're my figure because your brain. I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, no. where did you get this? I don't know. I and Bros and Broski's the same way. Yeah, I'm sick of the psychology. I've always been a thinker. Like I think things through, like to the fullest. Nice, yeah. bro. We have to go visit Broski wherever he is, dog. Yeah, when we get to work, both us visit him. I like. Just pull up. Just pull up, pull up on him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we excited, bro. Yeah. Follow me by the best. Mm -hmm. You have to you have to put in a way that you can see who's your follower. Because you could blindly be following people and not you see someone walk by and don't know if they follow you or they believe in your sure. you not. So you have to do something that shows like, oh okay, that's my people, you know? Or that's like you know, they are my side, like you know, they see they see from my eyes. Mm -hmm. So example, it's not a good example, but it's an example. Um blood to the crypts I see. The the two things that became misunderstood and became bad, but they started off as a good thing, right? Mm -hmm. They started off as standing up for their neighborhood, but now they're gangs and violence, and it's mixed up now. But when you look at them, you can say, oh, that guy's a blood, he wears red. Like, you know, he represents it, whether it's good or bad. The next guy, he's wearing blue, he's a crip, you know, representing. Mm -hmm. So when I get up and, like, I'm luxury up and everything, and I make it, my color is going to be white, because white stands for peace. So you see, I'm going to wear all white, white and gold. And I'm gonna mm -hmm. say, if you're my people, wear white, you know? Mm -hmm. Show peace, because when you're wearing white, you don't wanna fight. So when you don't wanna, you you're know? Pure. You're too, yeah, you're pure. See what I'm saying? So they're gonna be like, okay, like, when they see each other, they're gonna die each other. Ah, oh, all right, like, you know? Blah, blah, blah. And then when I get rich, I'm gonna buy the neighborhood. See all neighborhoods, like, they're beefing with each other and shit? Mm -hmm. Imagine if they work together, they'd be so successful. Imagine if people. Exactly. So I'll buy all the neighborhoods and say, you can't be fighting this block. You guys both belong to me. You're both my neighborhood. So, how is my right hand fighting my left? Does that make it sense? It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. So I'm saying, yo, you guys work together for now. And I'm a make sure, like, I can't be the idiot that says work together for now and I expect them to do it because they're not. I'm going to have to step in and say, yo, like, you know, bring the good out of this side. Bring the good out of this side. Then bring them together. Make them work together. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm 
lavish. You're a superman, you know. Little do you know. <laughs> already rich? You're not trying you're not you're not trying to get rich, you're already rich. Rich in the mind, you see the wealth here. It's only a matter of time, man. Remember, all these billionaires and millionaires and all these people you see, they were rich before you see it. They were yes. rich before you knew it. Speak. Before you believed in them, they believed in yourself. And then after it just came out. <laughs> they had a billion a billion dollar mind, now you see a billion dollars around them. See what I'm saying? Jeez. Shit like that. that goes back to what I said in my first video, the first vlog that we just I just finished. Mm -hmm. uh, you'll see it. Like one of the ladies told me, she said Everybody is worth at least a million dollars. Exactly. Not even. Everyone in the world is worth more than all the money in the world. What did you just say? Hmm? What did you just say? Everyone doing good or bad, it's not really their fault. They just had bad guidance. A lie. So if you have someone good guiding you, you'll make it. And it's not the type of guidance like, oh, do this, do that, and all the rounds. You, you know what it's called? Them. Mentors. Yeah, mentors. But you need to also help them and walk them through it. Because sometimes it's not good enough to just tell someone what to do. Because I might say, oh, yo, go this way and that way, and you're going to get lost. Mm -hmm. And if I walk you through it a couple times, you're going to say, oh, I remember the path. And then you're going to be luxury. You know what I mean? Some, some, some true stuff. Yeah. We're still here watching DDG, the main guy behind yeah, all the inspiration. Shout out to DDG still. All right. We made off a dead son too. Shout out to DJG. He made it off of YouTube just recording videos. Anything in this world is possible. If a man like that can blow up, get verified everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Like, if Bill Gates can be a billionaire, why can't you? You know what I'm saying? Like, why not? He's a person just like you. He just thought of something and put it into reality. You just need to think of something and put it in reality. Don't think twice, don't think three times, just think of it and say, let me try it. Try it and see how it goes. You might fail, you might say, you know what? It was a good idea, but this was bad. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And you're going to fix it up along the way.